Hello everyone, welcome to MS Safety webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to exclude files and folders path from Microsoft Defender Scan using Intune. We can exclude certain files, folders and processes from scanning via Microsoft Defender Antivirus. Exclusions will get applied to scheduled scans on-demand scans and always on real-time protection and monitoring. Please note that Microsoft Defender Antivirus includes a lot of inbuilt automatic exclusions based on known operating system behaviors. In case you are excluding a file or folder path from scanning and real-time monitoring in Microsoft Defender, you have to make sure that you trust that file or folder path and know that the file or folder contents are not malicious. There are different ways to achieve this. We can use antivirus policy, device restriction policy, or PowerShell script to exclude a file or folder path from scan in Microsoft Defender. In this video, we will be using antivirus policy. First of all, we need to sign in to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center as a Global Administrator or Intune Administrator. We can access Microsoft Endpoint Manager using the URL https endpoint.microsoft.com. On home page, click on Groups. We have created one test device group with the name Test Win Client. Click on Test Win Client. Under Manage, click on Members. We can see we have two members in our test group Lab Win 10 CLI01 and Lab Win 10 CLI02. Let's go to our Windows 10 device Lab Win 10 CLI02. We can check the current exclusion list in Windows Defender on our system by using PowerShell command. Right click on Start menu and click on Windows PowerShell Admin. Click on Yes. We need to use this PowerShell command to get the current exclusion list in Windows Defender. Hit Enter key to run the command. As we can see, Currently, there are no exclusions applied on this device. Once we apply the exclusions, we will rerun this command on this device to check if it's been added to the list or not. Let's go back to Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. Click on Endpoint Security. Under Manage, click on Antivirus. Click on Create Policy Plus icon, then select Windows 10, Windows 11 and Windows Server as a platform. From the drop-down list, select Microsoft Defender Antivirus Exclusions as a profile type. Click on Create. Type a meaningful name for this antivirus policy. We are giving name. Taste Microsoft Defender Antivirus Exclusion Policy for Windows Devices. Type a description for this policy, which is totally optional. Click Next to continue. Here we will see options for configuring Microsoft Defender Exclusions. In this video, we want to exclude one file path and one folder path from Microsoft Defender Scan. So for that, we need to configure excluded paths setting. Toggle the setting to configured. Let me manually type the file and a folder path. I have added one folder path and one file path. You can also import the file or folder location by clicking on this import or export button. Once you specify the paths, Click on Next. We'll go with default scope, so I'm going to click on Next to continue. On Assignments page, 
click on add groups to add our taste device group here we will select our taste device group name win client click on select in this video i have used device group but instead of device group you can also target user groups but it is mostly a matter of preference if you target a user with a policy and they get a new device you don't need to worry about adding that new device to a group or policy we could be using dynamic device groups to get around that but the evaluation for those groups isn't instant so it is up to you which type of group you want to target in this example i have used a device group click next review your selection which you have configured when you are ready click on create to create policy with configured settings wait for the confirmation message we can see the message policy taste microsoft defender antivirus exclusion policy for windows devices created successfully to taste this policy result let's go to our windows 10 device first we will perform the manual sync with the intune let me click on sync okay sync has been completed successfully go back to windows powershell and again run the command to check the current exclusion list in microsoft defender let me press enter key okay the policy is not updated yet so let me again initiate the sync okay sync was successful uh, let me again rerun the command and this time we can confirm that the file path and folder path has been successfully added to the exclusion list we can also check microsoft defender antivirus exclusions from the device itself search for windows security click on windows security click on virus and threat protection under virus and threat protection settings click on manage settings scroll down to find exclusions click on add or remove exclusions click on yes we can see that the two exclusions we put in place one for a aps database folder and another one for aps soft.exe file please make sure that you understand the risk associated with not scanning certain files or folders and also make sure that you are adding a folder location which you trust that does not contain any malware or any unknown files that's all for this video on how to exclude files and folders path from microsoft defender scan using intune thank you all for watching this video have a nice day